Brad here with Twisted Elk Brewery. This is part four of our plate filter tip series. Uh, today we're going to max out this 20 by 20 plate filter system. We wanted to see could we filter 10 barrels with this. What is the maximum amount of beer that this filter system is capable of? So we purchased additional filter plates and we have a total of 41 plates including the end plates and it holds 40 pads. Now it was a little tricky getting those last two pads in here. We had to like tighten it down and compress the, the, the pads a little bit, then open it back up and we were able to get the last two in there. So we did also set up our back flush uh, rig right here, just in case we get into trouble, we can actually back flush, uh, pull some of that yeast out of the pads and then resume flow. But I'm gonna try not to do that. I wanna see if we can do one single pass all the way through with these pads. So we're gonna check this out right now. So far, so good. You can see how cloudy the beer is in the sight glass here. Then we follow over here through the plate filter. And look how clear and nice that looks right there. Okay, we just finished the transfer. It took us about two hours. We did not have to back flush. It went straight through. So 40 pads was plenty to do a 10 barrel transfer. Now, this was fairly clean, but you can see the sample. This is the before and then the after, and the after looks extremely clear. So um, it was a great filter session. Um, definitely gonna call it a success right here. So I think that this is a viable option. If you have a 10 barrel system and you're looking for a plate filter, this is definitely a viable option. 